How to test a 24-volt DC solenoid valve, good or bad. The solenoid valve quality, good or bad, is decided by the coil and the valve. Therefore, it mainly take a test on this two parts to check if the solenoid valve is good or bad. This is a 24-volt DC solenoid valve and how can we know it is good or bad? Let us make a test for it. First of all, find a 24 volts power source and connect it to the coil. If any noise is heard, it means the solenoid valve coil and valve element are normal, which can ensure normal connection. Then, leakage detection is conducted. It is the best if there is the air supply, for the air supply can be directed injected to judge whether gas leakage exists. If there is no air supply, block the air outlet and blow it using the mouth. Testing the coil of solenoid valve can also be conducted with the multimeter. Power on the solenoid valve, take off the connector plug, and use the multimeter to test whether there is power or not. Power on the solenoid valve and move the thin steel wire close to the coil to see whether its suction is viable. Repeat testing of the solenoid valve power on and off. Use a thin internal hexagonal wrench to poke at the brass, small pits, on the solenoid valve axial, to see whether absorption ejection is normal. The specific method to detect the solenoid valve quality is as follows. And there is also the detection methods for some common faults of solenoid valve. Get the solenoid valve connected with the medium, the liquid or air with the pressure, and the voltage value is the intermediate value of the solenoid valve voltage scope. Get the solenoid valve coil with power. If the medium changes from power on to power off or from power off to power on, it means the solenoid valve is good. Otherwise, the solenoid valve has problems. Solenoid valve coil short circuit or open circuit first. Use the multimeter to measure its on, off status. When the value of resistance is close to zero or is infinitely large, it is an indication of coil short circuit or open circuit. In contrast, if the value of resistance is normal, around dozens of ohm, it cannot yet prove that the coil is in a good status. To ensure reliability and accuracy of your test results, please carry out the following final test. Find a small screwdriver and place it nearby the metal pole in the solenoid valve coil. Then, power on the solenoid valve. If magnetism is perceived, it means the solenoid valve coil is good. Otherwise, the valve coil has been damaged. A method to cope with the above problem is to change for a new solenoid valve coil. Troubleshooting solenoid valve S. There are some faults in the actual installation and application of pilot-operated solenoid valves. For example, the pilot-operated solenoid valve doesn't work properly, has lower fluid transmission.